channel. In today's session, we are going to see the proof of cosine rule, which is the most important theorem for the board examination 2025. So let's see the statement and proof of the theorem. The cosine rule. Okay, so here in triangle ABC, in triangle ABC, first a square is equal to b square plus c square minus 2bc cos a second b square is equal to a square plus c square minus 2ac cos b and third one c square is equal to a square plus b square minus 2ab cos c so we have to prove this one so now let's see the proof of theorem so to prove i'm going to take one triangle so here first i will draw x axis and y axis so So this is my x axis and y axis. So here I am going to take triangle. Okay, so this is triangle. Now we have to name it. So this is y axis, this is x axis. Now, if you are going to prove the first one, that is a square plus b square minus 2bc cos a. Okay, so cos a, angle a. So write origin as a. Okay, so I'll mention this one here, angle a. Now B and C kisi bhi likh sakte so I'll write here B and this one as C, okay. Now one thing, the most important thing, ki jo triangle ABC hai, isme sides ki value put karna hai. So dekho, vertex A ke saamne jo opposite side hai, usse denge small a length. So here, this is small a, vertex B ke saamne jo length hai, isse hum likhenge B, small b, and vertex C ke saamne jo hai, isse bolenge small c okay now so by using these we can write the coordinate of the point so since a is origin so here it is 0 comma 0 now point b is situated at a distance of c unit from point a so we can write here c comma 0 and the most important part vertex c okay so since here it is angle a okay and ac as we are performing here as a R. So the relation between the Cartesian coordinate and polar coordinate is given by x is equal to, let me write here, x is equal to R cos theta and y is equal to R sine theta. So here theta is angle A and R is B. So here x will be B cos A and y will be B sine A. So the coordinate of point C will be here. This is B cos A and B sine A, the most important part. Okay. Now, so whatever we have written here in the triangle, so we have to write here. So take, take point A as origin. Okay. Now, x axis alongside AB, x axis along side AB, okay, and perpendicular and perpendicular from 
point A that is y axis. Okay, now I am going to prove the first one. So, see here. So, first one that is a square is equal to so I am taking as this one a square is equal to or let me write here left hand side first left hand side is equal to a square okay so a square means what length of segment BC so it means we can use the distance formula so I can write here C minus b cos a the whole square plus 0 minus b sin a the whole square okay so let me slide some little bit upper now up kya karenge a minus b ka whole square ka formula apply karenge in both brackets so we'll get a square minus 2 abc type okay so it will be 2bc cos a plus b square cos square a plus here 0 minus b sin a it means de definitely minus b sin a the whole square so it will be b square sin square a okay now i will take b square common from this one so we'll get c square minus 2bc cos a plus b square in bracket cos square a plus sine square a and we know that sine square a plus cos square a is 1 so we'll get c square here b square into 1 so i'm writing here b square first minus 2 bc cos a which is right hand side okay so similarly we can prove the second and third one 